In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to switch characters in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Switching your characters mid-battle is a key mechanic for strategic gameplay. So of course, after you select the initial characters from the MVC2 roster, you will be able to use a specific string of buttons to change them. So, if you want to use the buttons, all that you have to do to switch to your second character is press Light Punch plus Light Kick. So, just use Light Punch plus Light Kick and you will switch into the second character that you have selected from the roster. And if you use Heavy Punch plus Heavy Kick instead, this switches you to your third. So essentially, for PlayStation, press Square plus X. This will switch into the second character. Now, if you want to switch to the third on PlayStation, press Triangle plus Circle. Finally, if you are on Xbox, press X plus A on your controller to switch to your second character and press Y plus B for your third character. So I'm gonna lay everything on screen so that you can take a quick look. You can only switch characters when your current character is not in the middle of an attack or animation. Switching characters can be used offensively to extend combos, escape pressure, or set up specific team strategies. You can also switch characters during a hyper combo to bring in a fresh character for additional combo or damage potential. So once again, you just have to press the buttons related to Light Punch plus Light Kick at the same time to switch to the second character, or if you want to switch to the third character instead, press the buttons related to Heavy Punch plus Heavy Kick. For PlayStation, those are going to be respectively Square plus X and then Triangle plus Circle. For an Xbox controller layout, it's going to be X plus A, and then Y plus B. You should see your character go out immediately, and this is all you have to do. I hope I was able to help you on how to switch characters in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.